YouTube another video. All right, got another 10, but I'm also going to go ahead and knock one of these boxes out as well. But I don't know what day it will be uploaded, but um, I do have some update. If you saw my um, movie and uh, horror pack unboxing, you basically saw where I'm talking about the bad news. So the bad news that happened was I went to the medical college down here in uh, Augusta, Georgia. And I had my appointment for my teeth surgery. I was going to get my teeth fixed. Oh man, I don't know. I just got bad luck or whatever, but I waited years for to get approved for this uh surgery. And I, I already had to deal with one delay from them on their part. But I woke up that morning, yesterday morning, kind of nervous, scared, you know, because I never been in surgery before, and uh, you know, that just runs all kinds of butterflies in my stomach. I got the Filled out, you know, the paperwork like they wanted me to, you know, uh, blah, blah. And, like, uh, during surgery, they always ask you, have you had water or anything to eat um, within 24 hours? I told them I haven't eaten anything in 24 hours. But I took a little sip, you know, some uh, water, you know, to clear my throat because I get bad dry throat in the mornings when I wake up. And that lady had a nasty attitude. And she really made an issue to say, oh, well... You can't have nothing to drink within 24 hours. Now, I know that's a flat-out lie because there's people out there who take their medicine, you know, with water, and they allow it. What I think what happened was I brought my roommate, you know, because I don't have the luxury. I don't have friends or family, okay? So I have a roommate, you know. She was going to be my the person who comes there and, and, you know, take me back home. Well, I, I think what happened was my roommate was about to uh, come and drop me off. And she was going, hold on, I got a kitty with me. But um, she thought she could like go around the corner and, and you know, there's a little training area. She could go train and um, they're going to call her back, you know, uh, whenever I woke up. And she could take me home because it's just around the corner. But, you know, with them... They say you got to be there throughout the whole surgery, you know, in the waiting room. And um, I think her wanting to go across, you know, to this place, you know, the train, I think it rubbed uh, the front desk person bad or whatever. And that's the reason why they went ahead and told me bye. They was like, no, nah, you can't do it. But she tried to use the excuse of, oh, you drunk something, you know, you can't drink anything within 24 hours. And that's bullshit to me, you know, excuse my language, but. That, that, that really hurt, you know, hurt and disappointed me because I've already had to deal with, you know, years to get approved. And then I was delayed, you know, for three months. And now I got to wait another three months. So I got to wait till July the 29th. And, you know, it's just, it, it, it kills me because I was up there, you know, I was there on time, got bullshitted. And, and I don't know what the hell the front desk lady did, you know, whether she has a bad day or whatever. It, it ruined things for me, you know. She definitely, you know, somebody who suffers from depression and, and PTSD. Yeah, that, that really did a number on me yesterday. But anywho's, anywho's, enough, enough bad news. I just want to update y'all. You know, it kills a lot of plans I had. Uh, I had, you know, plans. And, you know, I'm, I'm real ca uh, cautious about how I look, you know, with my mouth. You know, yes, we can have, like face masks and on, you know, the pandemic, but still, you know, I had plans and I can't do those type of plans no more. I got to wait three months. <sighs> Let's see if we can get some good news out of these pools, okay? I'm going to go ahead and try to do some of these early, you know, that way um, when I do upload it, you know, the time frame, I, I have some backups, you know, I don't have to pull something out or see what's going on. But here's the right you it's pretty nice you know here you see it and yes it is the card i pulled from the last 10 so let's see if we can get some more nice ones because the tens there's always straight i've not really had any warped cards you know um so i got this in i got one more of uh the other one the water uh pokemon right there i got him coming in let's see what we get today Uh, 
Uh, today's Friday, let y'all know. It was a uh, restock of, you know, uh, down in some places. Unfortunately, my roommate woke up late, so she canceled and I suffered. <laughs> oh, man, it'd be nice to get some retail stuff. But at least Target has some stuff up and I was able to get uh, a Battle Styles Elite Trainer Box. You know, at least I was able to get that at retail price. And those were the, the ones that canceled off wave one, so I'll be getting those. And here's a close up of the right Chew GX. It looks good, don't it? And it's all straight, nice, no warp. I like the color of it. I'm old, I always like hollows, you know, back as in the 90s when they first started doing hollows and all, I was happy just to see it as a kid, and it still gave me today. <laughs> All right, like always, we get four packs, and they always got the good ones on the cover, right? <laughs> and these are the hidden fate. I kind of like the hidden fates, what I've seen so far. Let's see, let's see what we get today. Nice. Get to Walmart. Well, of course, you're going to go tomorrow, but I'm pretty sure ain't no Pokemon stuff going to be there. I do need to get some new gloves because this one has, yeah. And like always, I tell people, you know, I don't have dry hands, so I don't want to get no fingerprints or anything, anything. Let's put this up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Coughing to start it off. The same old, same old basics. And then, ah, uh, we got a Trainer Hollow Reverse. That's nice. And we got Erica's Hospitality. I like that. So we off to a good start. And that Butterfree. I never liked this Pokemon ever. <laughs> we call this the Butthead. <laughs> Magmar, the Butthead. Farfetched. I like Farfetched. So none too spectacular. Something decent, right? I'm going to with pack number two. Let's put this somewhere which my cat will not step and try getting to. Magic card. The card card. Pikachu. The uh, yeah, I kinda prefer the old school, the OG Pikachu, the fat boy himself, the jubs. <laughs> they really made Pikachu tiny, small, and he really don't even look like himself like he used to. In fact the first two designs I can put it this way. He kind of looked like his newer characters, you know, the, the ones they put out, but. Yeah, but it is. Chigglypuff. Yeah, reverse hollow. Jancy. Not bad. Jolting. I think that's all we got. In the, nothing rare or anything. This is determination. A lot of training. So right here. The only one type of hollow. So we haven't pulled that great great yet. It'd be nice if I can out with these uh tins, you know. The last ten was good. I've always seen uh, other people with these tins that uh hidden fates and shiny fates, you know. So let's see, let's see. Off to number three. This time we're starting with Clefairy. Slowpoke. 
that's that's always a weird character, especially depending where the clam clatch a song. <laughs> ah, Pikachu again. Alright, and here's the hollow. This time it's just a hollow, not a reverse. Magneton. It's nice and also in the back. Yeah, we got another hollow. Sapdos. Hold on real quick. Ah, uh -huh. Poopa. Come here. Come here. Whip, whip. Cappy and Bear, he's trying to get behind the, the sound system, and I never like it when he gets into corner areas because I never know if he wants to spray someone. So we went with a so so pull to a decent pull. Boo bye. Be good. Surprised he ain't fussing back at me. Every time I get on to him, he always whine back. Last, last one. I'm hoping for a big boy. I'm hoping for something nice, a nice pool. Because it'd be kind of sad if it didn't sound. And I'll be like, this is the 10 that was not the 10 for me. Charmander, Clefairy. Okay, and here we have Reverse Hollow, Jolton. Oh no. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this would be the 10 of 10s to be a letdown for me. I've always seen nice pools. Unfortunately, this was not the pools at all. So I can't say what y'all think of my dots because I think this was just a so so. <laughs> I thought I was going to upgrade it to decent, but no, it's so so. There was no. Nothing besides, you know, the front GX, no other GX, no V Maxes, no full arts. This was kind of a sad unboxing, right? <laughs> So I guess a uh, uh, a sad yesterday to go and match with the sad today. I should have said the other way around, but hey, this is how sad it is. <laughs> so go ahead, leave me some likes, some comments. Let me know how sad that was because I'm very disappointed myself. <laughs> but let's hope this uh box of battle styles I'm gonna open up be a little bit better, right? Y'all take care. Please subscribe. Enjoy.